everyone, welcome back. Um, as I said yesterday, today we are going to start with persuasive writing, or in other words, opinion writing. Um, we've done this multiple times in class, so this should be no different than us doing it here. Um, today we are going to do a graphic organizer. I will work through one with you. Um, I would like you to do it on your own though when you're done and not use all of my examples. I'm happy that if you pick and choose a few of mine, um, but please do not just copy my whole essay down or graphic organizer down. Um, so today's prompt is going to be what animals make the best pet. So you will need to think about what animal you think makes the best pet and then once you have that, you are going to fill, start filling in your graphic organizer. Um, yours will look just like this. Um, let me show you. It will look just like this. You'll have this top box up here. This is where you'll fill in your opinion. Please make this a complete sentence so that when you write the essay portion tomorrow that it's a little bit easier for you. Um, then you have this portion down here. This is going to be reason one, reason two, reason three. And underneath each of your reasons, you need to fill it in with examples and explanations. Um, so I think you can see that, but you also have it in front of you or you have it on your Google Classroom, depending on what you are doing. So to start, I made one on the whiteboard that looks pretty similar to yours. It just doesn't have the cute little picture on it. So you need to start this off by filling in this top portion. So you're gonna start by saying something along the lines of, in my opinion, and then comma, and then you're gonna fill in the rest. In my opinion, I believe, or I think, or I know, whatever you want, I believe dogs, are the best pets for many reasons. Okay, and then you're gonna just fill something in like that. Um, you don't have to choose dogs. Whatever you wanna choose, you can use. Um, yeah, definitely does not have to be dogs, but that is what I think is the best pet, so I'm gonna go with it. Then I need to come up with three reasons. Um, I have already brainstormed myself and I already took notes on what I wanted to talk about throughout my essay. So the three reasons that I think dogs are the best pets are one, because they're loyal. Two, because they're smart. And then three, I said protective. I think you can still see. Now, this is not a complete graphic organizer if I just left it there like this because I have not explained myself. Um, the more you explain yourself, the easier writing the essay tomorrow will be um, because then you just have more evidence to put into your essay. Uh, tomorrow we will be writing a five paragraph essay using this. So the more evidence and examples that you put into it now, the better it will be. Um, okay, so for my explanations for these, um, for Loyal, I was thinking, well, every day I come home, my dog, Kona, most of you know her, um, is always excited to see me. So no matter what kind of day I have, she's always gonna greet me at the door so I'm gonna put that, um, always happy to see me. And your explanations or your examples don't need to be in complete sentences right now. They can kind of just be in notes. Um, so always happy to see me. That could be one, then maybe I'll put a semicolon for another. Um, comes back when I call her. Remember, in persuasive and opinion writing, you're really trying to prove your point to somebody else. So the more examples you have, um, the better you are 
going to be about trying to prove your um, writing to them. Now if I move on to smart. So why, is, why are dogs smart? Um, many dogs know tricks. Many know their name. Um, let's see, what else? Potty trained. So you can keep going with more examples, but those are just some that I have come up with. Um, and then when I go to protective and I try to come up with some examples of protective, I can say bark when somebody comes to my door. I could say um, she's always watching through the window. And I could keep going if I wanted to, but I'll leave it there like this so that you get a good idea of what I'm trying to do for you. Um, you are going to do this today. Choose any pet that you think would be the best and then give me reasons and then give me an explanation or examples. Um, this is going to be your only video on graphic organizer this week. You'll have another topic on Thursday and you'll do the same exact thing, but you'll follow the prompt for that day. Um, I will see you back tomorrow so that we can format this in a five paragraph essay. If you have any questions, please let me know. Again, this is on Google Classroom and it is also on um, your paper-based packet. Um, feel free to color coordinate it if you would like to. Have a wonderful day.